Good afternoon and welcome to the channel. I'm Paul the Tech Giant and today I want to talk to you about the latest software update for the LG C10, G10 and W10 OLEDs. Now since my previous software update video I've been inundated with messages from you guys about a new software update that is now available. Now I did mention this in my previous video but at the time it was only available to download from LG's website and not over the air but I have since downloaded it over the air. If I just quickly show you guys what the version number of that is. So if I do a long press on the settings button, go down to support and software update, we can see that there, which is 03.23.06. And the previous version that I was on was 03. Uh, sorry, 03.21.18 and I decided not to update at the time to the previous sort of version that I spoke about before because there were rumors about it decreasing the brightness. But as far as this new one goes, I have been running this for a few days and personally, I have not noticed any issues with it whatsoever so far. Uh, again, looking around online, there have been a few people that have complained that they have lost brightness. It seems to be an ongoing thing. Now, I don't know if this is just sort of uh, panel variants and things like that. I I've not got a clue what is going on, but some people are saying like with every update that they are experiencing brightness uh, reduction and things like that. Me personally, I've not noticed anything at all. Other people say they have. So as far as this software update uh, goes, um, it's a sort of bit up in the air really, you know, on, just on based on what I've experienced, I'd say go for it, there's no issues. But you know, just bear in mind there have been a few people complain about. But let's have a quick look on LG's website to see what they say exactly this software update has to offer. Now on LG's website, as we can see, 03.23.06. If we scroll down using the uh, magic remote there, and uh, we can see, so improvement, who, where, what service that informs, details of current program will be available in UK, brackets UK only. And then number two, software update contains minor bug fixes. And uh, the list there for the models, as I said, is basically all the Gs. Um, I think it's a W as well. Yeah, there we go, a W model. Uh, which is a wallpaper and uh, the one that everyone really wants to know about is the C model as well. So uh, yeah, all these C10s and all the different sizes and variants. Now, one thing that is worth bearing in mind that once you have done this update, there is a new user agreement that you are really gonna have to uh, agree to if you're gonna wanna use all the services and such like. So please just bear that in mind because I know some people are funny about what they're agreeing to, which is, you know, fair enough. So just bear that in mind. If you are gonna do this update, you are gonna potentially have to sign up to some new terms and conditions. Now, one great thing about YouTube is that it reaches such a wide audience. And I would love to hear your feedback on this update if you have already done it. Do you think it's a good one, a bad one, or you've just not noticed any difference whatsoever? It's really great when you guys get involved in the comment section and say, you know, whether you find a, a positive experience with these updates or a negative one, you know, it helps to build up a picture so we can all learn from these updates and hopefully sort of get more improvements for these TVs over time. So yeah, make sure we hit up that comment section. I always love to hear what you guys have got to say. Well, anyway, that is all for today. So thanks very much for joining me. And if you have enjoyed this video, I would really appreciate a thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed, then please do so. So catch you guys on the next one. Bye for now.